So you have a Roku Smart TV, doesn't matter what brand TV, it could be a TCL or Hisense or another brand, it doesn't matter. But you have an issue where the screen is black or it's flickering black. However, the audio is on. I'm gonna show you guys how to fix that in uh, two possible steps, okay? So first thing is make sure the audio is on, okay? You can just grab the, vo press the volume up and down. You can hear the uh, audio, or you can hear the volume, okay? So first thing we wanna do, because the audio is working, let's pretend the screen here is black. What we wanna do is we wanna reset or basically restart the TV using a certain key combination on the remote. The combination is gonna be, here's the home button right here. We wanna do home button five times, one, two, three, four, five. Up once, rewind twice, fast forward twice. Let's do it together, ready? Home button five times. One, two, three, four, five. Up once, rewind twice, fast forward twice. And now you can see the screen doing funny things. Now it's gonna freeze right here and it's gonna wait a little bit. It's gonna turn off the TV, then it's gonna turn it back on, then it's gonna turn it off and then it's gonna go ahead and turn back on again. And then this whole process will take about one minute till it's fully up. After it's back up, then hopefully you have a picture and the black screen is gone and there's no more black flickering or anything. So I'm gonna go ahead and let this uh, first part continue to run. Like I said, it takes like a minute. See, it's shutting off now. Now it's gonna go ahead and turn back on. It's gonna stay on this, t this uh, Roku TV um, picture right here for a while and then it's gonna go ahead and reboot again. Okay, anyways, we'll go ahead and let that continue, okay? And if this, the, if the first step didn't work for you, the second step is this. Just go to wherever your TV is plugged. Make sure the uh, TV is actually on. And I want you to unplug it, wait 30 seconds, then plug it back in. And, and then once it's booted back up, hopefully the black screen is gone and you are up and running. Okay, so this is the second time it's turning black. Now it'll stay here and then give it a little bit longer, then it'll eventually uh, boot up as you can see right here. All right, anyways, let me know what step worked for you. The first one, or the second one. Good luck.